Hello and welcome back. So today I'm going to be doing the October Witches Roots box. I don't know the theme, but this box is $29 and that includes the price of shipping. So let's just go ahead and get into it because I'm excited. Let's see what we got. I freaking love October boxes. They always get me so pumped. All right, let's see what it says. Oh, <laughs> and I just saw the artwork and I'm already excited. Okay, so, and it's called The Witches Broom. During the sacred time of year, we spend a large part of our time focusing on our inner workings. This includes peering into the shadows, working with ancestral and spiritual guides, and using a variety of divinatory tools to bring clarity to our reality. It is vital that while we work through our practices during this time that we control the energies that surround us, as well as the energy that resides within our sacred space. In this very special collection, we work with a variety of wonderful companions to assist us in clearing and cleansing our space so that we may bring in the beneficial energies we seek. Very exciting. Okay, and the first little uh, Book of Shadows page that I saw is this. Very beautiful, I can't wait to add it to my book. This is so freaking cute. All right, and the artwork for the Herb of the Month is Blue Sage. Look how beautiful that is, very cute. And there we have those two. All right, the first thing that I see here looks like our crystal. It looks like quartz, but it doesn't feel like it. Look at that. I'm not sure what this is. Let's see what this says. Oh, it is quartz. It just says it's a tumbled clear quartz crystal. It says, as one of our most programmable stones in this mineral realm, clear quartz is a wonderful companion to every practitioner, a stone of light and amplification, this beautiful tumbled quartz stone has the ability to enhance the intentions that you purposely place within it. In addition, clear quartz embodies the concept of clarity and can assist you in understanding complex ideals and perceptions. As you work with clear quartz, allow its energies to enhance the magic that flows through you and your sacred space. There. And we have Kopal incense. It smells gorgeous and then we have this sage bundle and i'm assuming this is the blue sage unlike white sage blue sage is found in the eastern and southeastern states it is commonly cultivated to provide its own unique energies a wonderful alternative to white sage this unique herb is less potent in smell and smoke and carries with it the ability to bring in new energies instead of distinctly dispelling negative energies the floral qualities that are associated with blue sage bring calmer notes to its aroma Although blue sage can dispel negative energies within your sacred space and ritual area, it is well known for its ability to attract success through prosperity and abundance of all kinds. In addition to attracting these energies, blue sage is an extremely mindful herb, promoting relaxation, relieving stress, and calming anxious thoughts and emotions. While using blue sage as a clearing smoke, the energies of comfort and guardianship can quickly be felt. This specific wand can be broken down and burned in small amounts within a fire-safe bowl or simply burned as a wand. We always recommend burning blue sage before rituals to set your space and cast your circle as you allow the smoke from this blue sage to walk throughout your space. Take the time to vocalize your intentions for doing so. As you speak clearly and out loud, your intentional energy becomes more potent and apparent, assisting you in manifestation. We have associated this blue sage wand with the witch's besom for its ability to clear and assign the sacred space. Very cool. This is the white light cleansing mini spell candle. The next thing I see here, it looks like a little rune. The Protected Home Bind Rune. The Bind Rune was created exclusively for this very collection. Placed within its design are the runes of... I'm not going to pronounce any of these right. Raid Ho, Algiz, Othala, and uh, Zeus. <laughs> these runes combine the energies of journey, protection, home, and intuition. This Bind Rune can be placed within sachets or mojo bags or used within any magical practice you feel called to include. Very cool. And then we have our oil. And it is the Psychic Besom Magical Anointing Oil. I don't think you guys can see anything in there. Let's smell it. It smells delicious. It smells like mint. This Psychic Besom Magical Anointing Oil has been created with the intention of clearing any clutter that may be clouding your intuition and psychic sight. As you anoint your skin or ritual tools, visualize your mind becoming free 
from anxious thoughts. As you focus on your breathing, allow yourself to slowly become aligned with your higher purpose. We have enchanted this magical anointing oil with rosemary, peppermint, and clary sage oils and have included rosemary and mugwort herbs as well. Inside your oil, you will find a Lemurian cord set to personify oneness within your aura. And they have also included a special mixture of the third eye magical anointing oil from the personal cabinet of witchery. Very cool. Okay. And now on to the last item in the box, which I guess is the besom and also a necklace. And this is what it looks like. And it says broom, cleansing home, journey, spirit contact, protection, purity, and intuition. The broom, Christopher Penzak, pendant with chain. We are so thrilled to have the opportunity to include such a meaningful pendant into this collection. This pendant has been designed by Christopher Penzak, known for his extensive authorship. Christopher Penzak is a witch, teacher, author, writer, healing practitioner, and the founder of the Temple of Witchcraft Tradition and System. On the back of this pendant, you will find the following inscription. Broom, cleansing, home, journey, spirit, contact, protection, purity, and intuition. As you wear this pendant, allow it to remind you that it is within your power to use the witch's besom, besom to bring clarity and beauty to your surroundings. Cool. All right. So that was everything that was included inside of this month's witch's roots box. And here is the entire page if you would like to pause it to read about it there. If I had to pick a favorite item, it's definitely going to be the Psychic Besom Oil. It just smells amazing. And of course, the artwork. Let me know down below what your favorite item was and what you thought about this box. And I'll see you guys in next month's video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.